Hello everyone, it is Susan here and let's just plan. So today I am super excited to be doing a collaboration with Caitlin Mitchell and I will have her YouTube link below as well as her Instagram link. And you can also find her as Caitlin Plans over on Instagram. So I've been watching Caitlin for, I don't know, um, I don't know, six months now, I would say. And her channel is growing. Her Instagram is growing. She has such a great eye for, I want to say design, for balancing a page and putting colors in the right spots and uh, even the angle that a sticker may go, you know, whether it's vertical or horizontal. She just has such a good eye uh, for making a planner page. And so I've really been enjoying her, her um, videos and her photos over on Instagram. And so definitely please go check her out. So we're doing this collaboration together. And the theme of this collaboration is black and white stickers with a pop of color. So my pop of color is pink. I don't know what Caitlin's is, so I'm excited to see what she comes up with. But um, yeah, so I have here um, just a whole bunch of stickers that I pulled out. And I have an idea for these. Um, this is sticker paper that I cut down i actually have to cut it down a little bit smaller to fit on this particular uh the classic size but and i also have the the design uh the plastic sheets made by the happy planner there's two of them together here and that's because this flower is holding them together um not that i know that i'm going to use this exact format but i did pull out the black and the white with the pop of pinks so that's what i'm going to be working with and i did go ahead and i like to um work in my wrong wrong notebook a lot i write in it almost every day not every day but i do like to um, have decorative pages in there to write on a journal a journal whatever comes up on my mind right nothing in particular but so we're working on the week of april 5th through the 11th so I took two pages out of the Wrong Wrong Notebook. I um, put the lines in here. So these lines are here from me. The stickers that are on here, the month and the days, are from this sticker book. And the other sticker books that I'm using, there are a lot. Uh, the Simply Lovely, this is like one of my new favorites. Flowers, Wild Styled, Colorful Florals, Happy Goals, and Pressed Florals. And I'm going to go ahead and get started. But before I do that, I want to show you kind of what my thought process is. Um, I want to, on the actual days, um, I want to try to have more black and white than pink. Um, so my first thought was, well, I'm just going to put pink flowers across the middle. And then I'm like, no, I think that's too much pink. Um, so I cut down these pieces of sticker paper and it's actually this right here, which is from by the well for God. And you can just find that website or they're still on Etsy and uh this is what i'm using is these clear matte sticker sheets and my thought is this that we're going to go ahead and put the flowers sporadically on these see so like now that i'm looking at this like this big one i don't know i don't know if i'm even going to use it but the smaller ones i cer certainly will and then i'm going to cut right so that the flowers are just on 
um, each square or rectangle, I should say. And then my thought is this, I'm gonna have one of these sticker pieces with the florals already on them, and I'm gonna do every other box. That's my thought. So I'm going to go ahead and speed up here and I'll do, um, I'll put some music on for you. Okay, so I'm going to work on these two stickers at once, right? And then I'll go ahead and I'll work on these two. So now my thought is this, that I'm going to take these pieces and let me move this over a little bit. And I am going to fill in, I don't have to fill in every single spot, um, but I do want to... Uh, fill in a lot of the this uh, open area here um, yeah and it's fine with me that they overlap I have no problem there now this one is going to be a problem only because it is paper so let me see if I can lift this one up a little bit which is a, a clear sticker and I'm going to overlap these. I'm going to put that paper sticker. I'm going to let it go over the edge and cut it. You know, this is extremely fun for me, and I find it very relaxing. All right, so now let me take the little pieces from the other and put them around this one. So this... Um, piece had bigger flowers on it where this one had smaller flowers um so let's see let's see i do want to fill in a little bit this spot right up here um but i don't know do i have a little piece that i can use or should i wait until i do the next two you know what i guess i can use this this is actually perfect let me go ahead and put that on there okay so these two are done so i'm ready to go with these two so now we're going to go ahead and work on these
Alrighty, so these are ready to go and I love them. Now I am not going to use this big um, flower in the middle. So I'll have to put that back into the uh, sticker book. All right, so I took off the backing on this one and you know, I'm not gonna worry about the little lines that are on the paper. It's fine with me. What I am noticing, I got a little piece here, so let me get that off. And, oh my gosh, I got so many little sticky things <laughs> all over the place. It's like stuck to my fingers and everywhere. Okay, so here goes. I hope this works as planned. Look at how pretty that looks. Look at how pretty. So I think I'm going to do it something like this. Here it goes. It's so weird to pull this off of the backing and it's just already all together. I think that that is like super pretty. Super pretty. So give this a try. And if you give it a try, let me know. I would love to know. Um, how you did with this. All right, here we go. All right, so look, it pulls off. There it is. Um, I think I have to get that one stuck down just a little bit better. And then this one's going to go here. I see a little piece sticking out. Cool. I don't like this one. That's got to come off. I need a different flower for right there in that one spot. So let's see what I can find here. Let's see. I don't need a big one. And I'm staying away from flowers that have green, greener, greenery on them as well. So maybe something like this, because there is a center, but it is white and black which is part of our theme. And if I put that right there, that works. I like that much better. That looks good. That looks good. Oh my gosh, this is like so much fun. It's kind of weird trying to line it up because it's not a solid color, if you know what I mean. Look at how pretty, <laughs> I almost wanna leave it like that. That is super pretty. So that's my pop of color. So now we're going to add the black and the white. So again, I have all of these out. So like, for example, um, like I don't know if I want to use this sticker or this sticker, but I don't think I can use this one because it looks a little big to me now that I, I'm putting this together. All right, so I am having difficulties with the stickers that I had over here. And I think the reason being is because I had these stickers on that plastic for, I don't know, probably a couple of weeks. So what's happening is the floral sticker that looked like this that I had on the bottom got totally destroyed. So I'm gonna see if I can maybe find another similar sticker. Let me just go ahead and just kind of do this and let's see what I really need and what I don't need. So I'm going to put this sticker over here on Sunday and Saturday and Sunday. And I just think that that is so very pretty. And of course it's pink and black and white. But let's go ahead and 
Um, I do want to have a good amount of writing space on these days. And at this point, you're going to see me just put down a lot of black and white stickers. See, so now that I have these florals coming into this space right here, I don't know what I want to put there. Maybe I'll put this little sticker there. So I don't want to cover up those flowers. Or not a lot anyway. So if I move this down. Yeah, okay, that looks good. That looks good. Awesomeness liking that so far before I put this sticker on I think I'm going to get this sticker down now the reason why I, I decided to go ahead and put this sticker down with the pink box is because I wanted to offset this sticker up here with the pink so I'm gonna put it here and I know it's going to go over um, it's going I'm going to put it over just a tad. I know it's going to go over the line on the right over here and that's okay. I like it. Super pretty. Super pretty. Yeah, I like it. Um so now I can go ahead and work over here. And I I don't know what I'm going to do with these middle boxes. I just might leave them as is. And you'll see I also put little pieces on here. So like I have a black star with gold outline. I have one here, I have one there. I do have some gold here. I have a little bit of gold up there. So we were able to, or allowed to, <laughs> per, per our rules for the collab, um, pull in some sort of, you know, foil. So now that I have, I'm thinking like I'm going to leave this blank so I can write in there on that day. On Thursday, I have that box and that box. Saturday, I have that box and that box. Wednesday, I have that and that. Tuesday, I have a lot of room to write on Tuesday. And Monday, I have a good amount of room to write. So now I have to decide, like I also have this sticker right here. It says, where flowers bloom, so does hope. I thought that that was super pretty, but I knew I might not have a spot for it. And I don't think that I do, so I'm not going to put that on. I have met the goal of the black and the white stickers. I have a little pop of the gold, which is fine. And then the pop of color, the one pop of color besides the black and the white is pink. I have no, oh, I do have a piece of greenery right there. Let me cut that off. Let me cut this off because this should not be here. All right, I did it, I did it. All right, I took off that leave. I did not really notice it when I put it on there. Um, so I do have the darker color in the middle, but it's all either black or white, right? Black and white, black, 
right? Black and white, black. So I think I did it. I think I have successfully um, captured the theme of this collab. And please leave a comment below. Let me know how you like this spread. I'm gonna go ahead and put it into my wrong, wrong notebook. And um, be sure to check out Caitlin's channel and her Instagram account. Again, the links are below. So this is my wrong, wrong notebook. I'm gonna go ahead and put them, I have to get all the way, you know what? Wait, I'm going the wrong direction. I'm gonna put these right here. Awesome, perfect, I love it. Caitlin, thank you so much for doing this collab with me. Um, I totally enjoyed it. I love my pages. I hope you do as well. And thank you so much, everyone, for being here. And if you would like, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button below. And yeah, this was a lot of fun. All right, thanks, everybody. Have a blessed week. Bye-bye.